the creator of courses in public speaking, salesmanship, corporate training, and interpersonal skills, Dale Carnegie was an American author and lecturer. Learning is an active process. We learn by doing. Only knowledge that is used sticks in your mind. The only way to get the best of an argument is to avoid it. An hour of planning can save you 10 hours of doing. You never achieve success unless you like what you are doing. Face the thing that seems overwhelming and you will be surprised how your fear will melt away. The life of many a person could probably be changed if only someone would make him feel important. Our trouble is not ignorance, but inaction. Let us praise even the slightest improvement. That inspires the other person to keep on improving. You are something new in this world. Never before, since the beginning of time, has there ever been anybody exactly like you, and never again throughout all the ages to come will there ever be anybody exactly like you again. Success in dealing with people depends on sympathetic grasp of the other person's viewpoint. All the king's horses and all the king's men can't put the past together again. So let's remember, don't try to saw sawdust. Feeling sorry for yourself, and your present condition, is not only a waste of energy but the worst habit you could possibly have. We all have possibilities we don't know about. We can do things we don't even dream we can do. If you are wrong, admit it quickly and emphatically. Get the facts. Let's not even attempt to solve our problems without first collecting all the facts in an impartial manner. If you want to keep happiness, you have to share it. One of the most tragic things I know about human nature is that all of us tend to put off living. We are all dreaming of some magical rose garden over the horizon instead of enjoying the roses that are blooming outside our windows today. Keep your mind open to change all the time. Welcome it. Court it. It is only by examining and re-examining your opinions and ideas that you can progress. Give the other person a fine reputation to live up to. If you want others to like you, if you want to develop real friendships, if you want to help others at the same time as you help yourself, keep this principle in mind, become genuinely interested in other people. There is no such thing as constructive criticism. Remember happiness doesn't depend upon who you are or what you have. It depends solely on what you think. If you can't sleep, then get up and do something instead of lying there worrying. It. Nobody is more persuasive than a good listener. Your smile brightens the lives of all who see it. Tell the audience what you're going to say, say it, then tell them what you've said. By criticizing, we do not make lasting changes and often incur resentment. We move toward what we picture in our minds. No matter what happens. Always be yourself. Fear is the result of a lack of confidence. A lack of confidence is the result of not knowing what you can do. A lack of knowing what you can do is caused by a lack of experience. A lack of experience is caused by a lack of doing something new. Talk about your own mistakes before criticizing the other person. First ask yourself, what is the worst that can happen? Then prepare to accept it. Then proceed to improve on the worst. Every day is a new life to a wise man. Life truly is a boomerang. What you give, you get. The successful man will profit from his mistakes and try again in a different way. If you must make a mistake, make a new one each time. The best things in life are yours, if you can appreciate yourself. People aren't interested in you. They're interested in themselves. Criticism of others is futile and if you indulge in it often you should be warned that it can be fatal to your career. Tell me what gives a man or woman their greatest pleasure and I'll tell you their philosophy of life. Perhaps you will forget tomorrow the kind words you say today, but the recipient may cherish them over a lifetime. All men have fears, but the brave put down their fears and go forward, sometimes to death, but always to victory.